Okay, uh, we arrived at the Scorch Village. Uh, we added a new card, uh, which is the first boss. And we decided to discard a merchant token. We have two merchant tokens. Uh, we draw three uh, cards from the item deck. Because now is as good as time as ever. We have 10 gold. So three cards. One, two, three. We have a health potion and a large health potion. Health potions can be used uh, to plus two uh, to one hero. Uh, we have one hero with uh, two wounds. Um, rejuvenation potion is for restoring all living heroes. And uh, we have a large health potion. But we can also use the information on what happens here. Um, So, the upcoming boss, I'm not worried about the Firewolf. The upcoming boss... Let's see... Uh, is, he has 12 plus the 6 hit points. Uh, so we need to do a lot of damage. I think we can do that with Kalatar. And tell this. Um, we need to match the, to the the icons, so it depends a little bit on. Uh, we have to draw the hand to five, six, three, four, five, six. And this star is uh, wild, so we can match this pretty easily. And I think the consequence is that we get 5 damage. I'm not worried about that. So for now I'm going to buy a rejuvenation potion and a health potion. This gets destroyed. And that's it. Um, so to move here we roll a die. Uh, custom dice. Uh, this and this. Let's see. Two speech bubbles. So we can discard these two. Or we can reroll because it's very easy. Otherwise, I would have discarded them from my hand. Um, let's reroll these two. Okay, we gain a speech bubble. And we gain uh, two wilds at the cost of uh, one uh, health. Okay, we're going to deal one damage to Ifaris. Ifaris is exhausted, but um, uh, which means that we can. Uh, we have matched the two bubbles. Uh, we are face to face with a firewolf. We need to discard. Uh, fight for at least four, so this would do nicely. Then we do the travel action. Uh, to travel, we need to reach uh, six move. Um, Let's do then the 3 plus 3 move. This is better. 6 move, okay. Uh, we have entered the Hateful Hill, boss of Tree of Woe. Um, first, we draw a new card. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. So. Um, should, shouldn't that be the dungeon entrance? One second.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, this should have been the dungeon entrance. So... Mm, not really sure how to enter from here to here, but I think you can just hop along. Uh, we are f going to fight the Tree of Well. Uh, for that we need a sword and a sword and uh, uh, an eye. So we discard these. If we discard this, shit. If we discard this, um, the problem is that you immediately lose if you have No, but we entered here. Um, I already. Uh, I would have to fill up my hands to six uh, because you place a card. Uh, you fill up your hand to six, and you can either use a camp or rest. Uh, uh, um, a mer merchant or a rest uh, action, and now we can just discard these three. Gain five. Oh, uh, we spent ten, so we gain five again. Um, and we have to deal twelve damage. So I'm going to exhaust Gothar to use his plus eight to a fight ability. 8 plus 5 is... Th oh, uh, I need to roll the die to determine. Okay, so it is 16. And in that, that case, plus 8 plus 10 defeats the boss tree of woe. We have successfully entered dungeon entrance cool um, when we enter the dungeon okay you see it's now slightly lower for thematic reasons um, uh, because you're descending <laughs> so first of all we meet the goblins uh, to reach the goblins Oh, wait, a new card means new actions. Um, two, three, four, five. Um, don't. N I have nothing to spend. Uh, there are enough cards in the uh, in the action pile, so you don't need to uh, arrest. Um, we roll the dice, and we need an eye and a sword. I hope you can see it. A sword we have, an eye we don't have. Well, we have, but we can re-roll. Uh, so I'm going to use this. Um, this places three wounds on Ostian, and I said this is an eye. Barely see it. Going to shorten the road a little bit. So here it is. Uh, so we uh, we are face uh, face to face with the goblins. We need to defeat them, and they have three hit points. And we can expand just four. To defeat them, we defeated the uh, goblins, we gained 3 gold. We have now 3 plus 5 is 8 gold. Mm, like so. Uh, then we need to travel. Uh, for traveling, uh, we spent 5 movements, if we can. Let's see. Well, that's one plus four. Huh? Five movement. Movement. When we uh, uh, enter a new location, uh, we refresh our hands, 
And now it's getting uh, tricky uh, because I only can refresh my hand at uh, there are only three cards. Oh, but I have three cards, so I can still postpone it a little bit. But I think I'm going to uh, rest now. Uh, so for resting, I expend the rest. Uh, token and I take all my discards and I shuffle them and I place them as a neutral pile. Uh, I think this is a good timing. Uh, okay, and what else can we do? We draw a new dungeon card. So again, going down, and not going to do the merchant thing yet. Um, so we travel to the cursed armor. Uh, sorry, we descend to the cur cursed armor. Uh, can we do that? Wait. Uh, I rolled this. Uh, one speech bubble. And not a speech bubble, but I spent a speech bubble card. Uh, five years. So we are face to face with cursed armor. Uh, then we need four fight. Four fights. So that's one and one, three fights. We defeat the cursed armor. Uh, we gain a uh, reward, one gold. We now have nine gold. Um, we travel to the uh, tunnels. Uh, to travel to the tunnels, we need uh, six move. And this is six move. So we arrived at the tunnels. When we are arrive at the tunnels, I'm going to shift this even more. Uh, like so. 